Gotta make sure I have all the type tools correct. I'm being pretty slow right now, cause I don't know. I guess I'm a little tired, but whatever. All right, we're finally done here, so let's go play some Animal Crossing. Also, I have to re-enable that when I'm playing Pikmin Four, just in case people come and be like, "Oh my God, you not believe what happened at the end of this game?" No, I haven't really looked into any spoilers. I don't plan to. Oh, we had a bug off on the main island. There's really not much of a reason I want to do it there anyways. It's like, whatever. I've already done everything from the last few years since, you know, since the game came out for a year straight or two. Oh my god, it's but I do not care. I'm sorry, it's just I'm not interested. Alright, let me see what we got. You think cupcake, I'm obsessed with cooking, so I'm thinking about what I keep around and cook with, blah blah blah. Okay, whatever. Can mixer and this. I'm gonna sell that. Oh, yeah, there's a bunch of cicadas around. Wait, is it someone's birthday? Oh, no, no, never mind. It's a bug off, that's why. Okay, I don't think they have any DIYs to make during the bug off because everyone's so busy doing the bug off. Yeah, there's just nothing much.
I enjoy this? Bro, I didn't even do a single thing. <laughs> okay, why are you in the way? Alright, whatever. Let me go sell some stuff and then we're gonna head to Happy Home just to get started with more home designs and see if there's any other interesting villagers I could work with. I'm actually Nook Miles. You know, I kind of forget that I had like two million. I thought I didn't. Oh well. Then again, I don't even have a million Nook Miles reached on my second island because I'm just not going to be too invested in it. But I spent so many Nook Miles for Nook Miles tickets so I can go get me some, some Nook Miles tickets for villager hunting. And uh, I already had a conversation about villager hunting a while ago. Alright, who do we got here? I see, um, Roswell, I think? Matilda, Renee, Peggy. I think Bilber and Genji just killing together. I never talked to him. Alright, let me see. Cap sent me this. Ooh, Pearl! You know, we could work on her first. Like how um Pinky's doing the hula, that's cute. Ricky, Paula, there's Lucy, there's Wendy. Yeah. Have I done a home for Lucy before? I can't remember. Let me see. Oh, I did. Okay. 
Well, that was like way, way early on. Literally the third member I had to do. Yeah, that was like super early on. <laughs> Or like the earliest I did, like I think that was like on a Saturday I worked on because I was doing like two homes per day. Because I did like Eloise and then the other one. I think it was Apple the next day, uh, on the first day and then like got more and I started working on them, like yeah. What else do we have? Pretty sure did Molly a home? Let me see. Yeah. Oh, like, a few months recently. Yeah, I'm running out of, like, interesting villagers to work with because I'm finding a lot of, um, I don't want to say unpopular villagers, but the ones that, you know, not many people have, like, not too many people have too much strong, fond memories with, I guess. Um, I see the science pod all the time. Safety barrier. Have it in green. I guess I can go get it in red. Not that I really need to, I just felt like it. Floor tiles. Yeah, we're good. And he just got a stool to sit on. Funny. Cause he was just standing there, and then like shortly after, oh, he is he on the top floor? Okay, let me go get the stool real quick. Alright, let's get started. Where is Pearl so I can start working with her? <clears throat> my ideal day, me cozy under my kutatsu eating oranges. You want me to invite Tangi over? You probably freak out. to Citadel. So it's kind of like a Japanese home. They really have to go with the, you know, this. I'm gonna do it. 
I could use the cherry blossoms, but honestly, she's not that pink enough for this. Okay. Dress, retro dress. We give her the orange hat since she wants to just enjoy eating. Maybe we can give her the orange hunting jacket. Give her the orange hat. Give her these retro shades. What was that? These are as orange as they, as they can get. I have a mixture of white and orange. I guess it'll do for now. Let's see what we're gonna do with this. Now, do I have anything for the outdoors? No, it doesn't seem like it. Orange one. Have the oddest way to block this off, but i to make the bridge, you know, important some way.
Do I have any orange bushes? What's this? So we have Seems like a lot of stuff are like indoors. Let's see what kind of orange flowers do we have. We can just throw these in. Yeah, I think we're good with this. Not much, but it'll have to do. So let's see here, so wallpaper.
don't know if she wants it any bigger, but let's see. Let's see what we could throw in. I think we'll save that for the room on top. We got any orange? No. an orange one for this? No. Oh, we'll use the white one. There's no orange one. Then we'll use white, white, yellow.
I'm gonna reduce the size down. See if we can manage like that. There's a lot more fitting if I just place them there. And oh, I have an orange one. Neat. What else? Pull oh, this here. Not much that goes with the orange. Just have this there on the corner. Or like extra seats <laughs> or whatever, I don't know. I have to remove it just because I it's going to bother me, but see what else. There's really not a lot I can just throw in. It'd be kind of nice that there was like one of them on what to call it low partition walls or something, but it's gonna can have that. Like something like this could work. That's not bad to have around here. What I'm going to do with this empty corner there. Let's 
go worry about some of the stuff here. I'm throwing everything here, like I'm not going to include this, because we already have a clock. <clears throat> As for the clothing, I think we'll put that up on... Put that on second floor. There's absolutely nothing to put on the ceiling, so... Oh well. Yeah, that's not so bad. I feel like I'm already throwing everything. Oh, okay, no, not this one. Yeah, I feel like I'm throwing everything, just not the bed, the futon, and the, the dressers, because I think I'm going to save those for the second floor. I think we're good. This is good enough.
This might go by real quick depending on how how um how fast the second floor will be for her, so we'll see how that turns out. Because we can have this just to wipe the tears off the eyes, but nah. I mean, I'm gonna do it anyway. And I'm not gonna bother with those, it's too much to polish up. So, nah. Let's go to the second floor. Got to check and see where they think throw in. All right, let's go throw in. this and we have an orange futon yes we do all right What else? I could stick with the white, but I kind of don't want to. Let's see, what else? Thank you. 
Yeah, that could work. Let's put on top. Let's go put this here. Let me see what else. Well, I forgot I could customize them. I think we're fine for now. Yeah, Pearl's home is pretty much gonna be done real fast. Not a whole lot, but at least it's good enough for the, you know, the sizes I to work with. I think we're good. We got our very first home done. Hooray! It only took like less than an hour because there isn't a whole lot of overwhelming stuff to throw in. Oh, I kind of like it. He's facing the other way. Come on! That's not where you're supposed to be sitting at. I went to get Daddle. I'm just gonna go. That's all I'm saying. Alright, 30,000 pokey. We are going to keep on working because we just got started. Okay, you know what? 
Sure. Sure one seems interesting. And also, I do get an extra bonus boost if I work with him, so I may as well take advantage of that. I forgot about, oh, who's taking over his spot? And I'm like, oh, it's Derwin. And then he just wants to have his home main. I'm like, sure. My smart study space. If we want the smart studies, but we gotta find the most quiet spot where he won't be disturbed too much. Maybe this one. Let's see what else we got. Let's go with that one. get started. Alright, what kinds of stuff does he wear? I'm curious. Arjo vest, graduation gown, And glasses, but like none of them are blue. I'm giving the Arjo vest and the, those darker rim glasses. And for his hat. I know he has a graduation gown. Oh, isn't there like a school hat or something? Yeah, there is. Yeah, we can go with that. Things a little basic. I guess this iron door plate is all I have.
go with that. We can make his um, home look basic. Entrance and all that, like that. We see. Still hate how we can't even center the house properly. Honestly, I would use it if it didn't have to look so cutesy and babyish. I'll go with this one. Make it look nice and pretty. Do I have any outdoor chairs? Uh, probably not.
throw that there. Uh, Before I change it to night time where his actual study session begins. I have no idea what that sound is. Is it supposed to be raindrops dripping? Or literally someone trying to walk in through the woods and try to like murder someone. No, that's not. It's blue, da ba dee da ba die. <laughs> hey random, nice to see you here, dude. Currently working on my second home with Derwin since he came up to be like, hey, make me a home. I'm like, all right, fine. Cause I was trying to see who else I should work with next since I worked with Pearl and then like that was pretty much it. It kind of, it kind of looks nice. It's like, you know, a, you know, a basic normal home with like a, uh, you know, telescope and this miniature library right there. I'm pretty still plays it. I can't even play normally, much less creatively. I, I, I'm only playing Owl Crossing every week. Just so I have like Owl Crossing stuff going on on Twitch and also... Because, like, I don't got much better to do. I mean, I could still be playing Pikmin 4 if I wanted to. But I'm like, I can still, um, I can still manage and just, just wait. Um, yeah. It looks fun as heck. I've been addicted to it so much. Exploring around, exploring the caves. Getting some items and all that. I've been enjoying it a lot. Been watching a streamer play it. I haven't seen anyone stream just in case of spoilers and also want to avoid um, much in advance as well. It legit takes the best part of each Pikmin. I haven't really um, noticed which... I mean, they did get the, the cave system back from Pikmin 2. And then, like... It did take like some of like the collect on stuff from Pikmin 1 and 3 and a few other things as well. So I, I would assume like yeah they pretty much like improved it upon for this game. Add so much quality of life stuff. Yeah I kind of kind of feel like how um how improved and smooth it is in in Pikmin 4 so it's like you know, I'm pretty satisfied with it.
Yeah, smart study base by killing at the beach. <laughs> oh my goodness. Alright, let me see. I'm gonna leave this on just because I need to see better. The, the blue light is making it look so dark. We'll go with the dark wood. No blue. Oh well. Wait, I didn't check the color for these. Navy blue. The manners poster. I mean, he's trying to be smart. So I think like this would be appropriate. Yeah, I've been literally playing through this game so much. It's like even after like I um, stopped playing Animal Crossing a lot starting this year, it's like the only thing I'm still coming back to is Happy Home, just because and it, just because I think like you know it still gets some people to you know who want to tune in to watch me um do something rather than just. Go to my island, do the same thing every hour, and then, like, that's it. <laughs> Just don't feel like playing anymore? I understand. I feel like Animal Crossing has been, like... I don't know what to say, but, like... We've already done, we've already done enough in this game, but at the same time... I don't think much people are active on there. Because of, like, new games and all that. But I was feeling all burnt out, so, yeah. Play newly for seven years. Anything animated to two for me? Dang. Almost three. It's, I only like play Animal Crossing every every like day for like nearly three years. And I had to, and I had to like play through a whole year on my second island. I'm like, this is like literally wearing me out way too much. So I'm like, I'm not gonna do it. But yeah, I I know like New Leaf just literally um. Got me engaged like so much not every like the first few years every day yeah i check back but you know I, it felt like i accomplished so much that there's nothing left for me to do around the game so it's like yeah that might be the only way you play if you get the second island but i'm not buying another switch yeah i wouldn't recommend it unless you really want more villagers a female player character on there, a Summon Hemisphere Island, or whatever other reasons. Because I feel like it's probably a lot more justifiable if you have like other reasons you want to, you know, play Animal Crossing, New Horizons for a second island. Yeah, like five characters on your main island, two which are female, but that's not what I'd make another one for. <laughs> You try for a seam? Yeah, a seam is not a bad reason as well. You had ideas? <laughs> oh, idea. But I have since forgotten them? Dang. You ever, like, remember what ideas you needed to do for your second island if you plan to in the future? You should probably jot them down or something. I don't know. I probably would if I want to be super duper creative. There's only one idea I remember, but probably because I know it can't be done to the way I want it done. Yeah, it's like, you know, you have like an imagination of how you want to design it, and then you're like, Okay, how am I going to make this work? It just doesn't seem like it's going to go... I thought it would turn out to be. 
So yeah. <laughs> I didn't really make like any um specific seams on my second island. I just, you know, made a second version of what my of my main island, but like very unique or something. Like I like I was gonna throw in like some things like you know a wedding area or uh, other things, but like I, I just kind of lost interest or something. I don't know. The thing you want later are impossible with the game's mechanics unless I hack it or something. A seasonal island, <laughs> yeah. A seasonal island isn't too bad if like you were going for like a let's say a Christmas theme island for example. That would f be fine. A Halloween sea mine, that wouldn't be too bad as well. Each corner is different season. Ooh, that's not bad. Yeah, like spring, summer, fall, winter. I can see that. Like the spring one could be for bunny day, summer, well, seashells and stuff, beach related stuff, I guess. I don't know fall with Halloween and then winter could be like Christmas. I don't know. Let's get some of sack again. Could have multiple things going on. And you know the only the only other reason I'm also playing is like I'm still trying to like get the last two recipes that I'm missing and then like I have like my entire DIY collection complete. It's just I can't find anyone who wants to help me get the last two ones, which are the attention pull rack and like one other thing that I completely forgot and I had to look back. <laughs> Cherry Blossom Easter, like I said. Yeah, okay, yeah. Cherry Blossom forgot about that, but I just felt like, you know, more holiday like themes. If I want to ground and match each season, each bush to available, all the trees in the area to be the same season's color, but it's not possible. Yeah, unless you use like custom tiles. It's it's gonna be difficult to implement all four seasons at once at the same time. Maybe get rid of every tree. <laughs> you only have it as designs. Yeah. Not, oh yeah, like the the freaking tree cutout that could work since you can customize them. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. See, we're thinking of some stuff, but it's only for like for you and not for me because like I don't want the ideas for myself. No, I mean, but that could be part of it. <laughs> yeah. Well, I want to use it as a partition. Alright, throwing the globe. Cool globe. It's a match with the blue color. What else can I throw in there? Hmm. Oh, 
throw the we could throw in the wooden waste bin. Alright, what do we have here? Have the homework set, of course. It's gonna need to study. No. I was thinking there was like, you know, an open book, like a literature book, but I guess no. I think it's running this clipboard. Duelist. Future practice. Hum Okay, that's not bad. Could be his notes. What? Use the uh, the banker's lamb. work. What else? Of a bookshelf in a bathroom. Let me see, what can I throw in? We need some kind of reading materials, am I right? Yeah. I mean, I could browse around through here, but like, I, I kind of want to like go with whatever I have listed on there. Like, the only time I would, like, browse through here is if, you know, I'm trying to, like, find specific items that they definitely don't have, and I'm like, you know, I'm just going to throw this in. Like, a bed, for example, if they don't have, like, a good bed. That's not a bad color for choice for him. It's in the curtain partition, but it's not gonna. Just be dumb having it there this way. What if I try... Put this here. Get rid of these. Mm -hmm. 
I don't know if that's normal on libraries or you know, similar designs like this, but I think I'll try with that. Why can't I include a bathroom, Derwin? Oh my goodness. You know what? Do something like that. Oh god, I forgot. I have this here. Ah! Oh! <laughs> I don't know, it just feels out of place to have a bookshelf in a bathroom. I have a three-way three doorway opener. I guess like what I could try doing with these two. Put this there. I forgot I could customize the scrapbook. Something like that. Wait, do I have any rugs? We have here. Earth rug. Even though, like, humanity has been extinguished in Animal Crossing World, Kappa. I'm joking. I don't even think that's true. At least as far as I know.
I was gonna like accent the wall, but it probably wouldn't matter anyways because of you know whatever. Just worry about how I'm gonna make the design work here. Maybe we do this, then around. Do we have anything? throw that there and you could probably put that there Ooh. what else what do we have to throw in put on top of the table because um maybe the camera oh you know i could put the humidifier gotta freshen up the room somehow gotta make it smell like it's smart Put the, the the trash bin right here to throw away like toilet paper and paper towels or you know not paper towels. Well, pretty much whatever we throw in the bathroom usually. I could just get rid of this. Oh, yeah, I could just set up the island counters if I want to. But I think I ha I'm fine with what I have around here so far. Just duplicate them and make like a lot of these books.
Different colors. Only because, like, there's really not much. See. I don't think I got enough if I want to throw in a microscope, painting set, and, and a couple others around. Potato pottage. Go board. Before I throw in a fan, in the bathroom. Now we have like the ultimate bathroom. <laughs> Let me see what else. Okay, you know what? We have a blue color for this one. Okay, this could work. We could probably use this for like the top floor. Even though I have this there. I, mean, I could throw in the study desk if I want to. Yeah, we're gonna put down the top floor. Alright, time for the wall stuff. I was almost gonna be like, alright, time to polish this up and then go to the next floor, but then I'm like, right, we need to go work on this. So... Put this, um, poster here. Blue fish flower. We'll go with the blue color. Let me see. We'll throw in this one. Walnut. You will not be disappointed by this home design. <laughs> Um... There's a blue one, I'm using that. Yeah, there is. Oh, there's a navy design. There's a blue one as well. You know, let's just run one of these. Put it right there. Look a lot better this way. But that's just me. Okay. 
Okay. I think we're fine for now. I'm gonna go change this to the steamy one. <sighs> go drip drop on the sink. Oh yeah, this. I wish I had a fan that can blow out actual cold air. Like, you know, at freezing temperatures. I think there is such a thing, but I don't know. Hearts on it. I'm being honest with you, there really needs to have a lot more interesting male duck villagers. I'm not saying the ones we currently have are pretty lame or whatever. I just feel like there isn't a whole lot of, um, good additional variety. And I mean to do that, god damn it. Yeah, I'm gonna freeze my frickin' lamp. Well, it's not mine, it's his. Sure, you know what? I want to make all the bookshelves super dizzy. I would love the old villager of an Animal Crossing and GameCube that they removed be back. But maybe we could see them in the next game, but you know, it'd be nice to see them return. I don't know which ones because, like, I haven't really played, um, the GameCube game too much. I mean, it did, but like not um, a whole lot to you know, check out all the villagers and other characters. Next game, Copium. <laughs> all right, let's go make him a bedroom. Actually, let's just go match with the, you know, secondary colors for the this room being white. Oh, he's blue.
we see So where's this photo? Like sure. We have anything. We could probably throw in the ant form. Can I put around here? I don't want to throw this in. There's a green one. Table. Honestly, I really wish the only rugs we have for him weren't just all three by three. Like, I know there's a smaller one that's two by two. Or even a welcome mat that we could use, but nah, they decided let's just go with these. These are more fitting. I think this could work. Always, my Apple Watch is always telling me to go stand up 10 minutes before the next hour. <laughs> you know, I'll throw this in here even though we don't really have any music playing. Right, we need to throw in... Let's go with this, I don't care. Alright. Sorry, Darwin. Pretty cute, not gonna lie, for a lazy duck villager. He's not bad. I just never had him, that's the same. You know, if, if we ever do get a new Animal Crossing game for the next console, I'll probably not prioritize too much on the same villagers I've had previously. 
Because then I'm not gonna be too well varied with who I collect. But any, like, newer characters introduced? As well as others that, you know, I'm kind of like, you know, alright with having. I'll probably prioritize that, but we'll see. done here. Alright, Duran, you better go study up and graduate. Get yourself like a career or whatever. I don't know. Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait. Before I do... There we go. I always realized I forgot I had the blue lights on. <laughs> it just looks so dark. It would have been difficult for me to, like, design like that, but, oh well. There we go. We got two homes made tonight. I was reading, like, a comic book. Yeah, he's not gonna study. He's just gonna read some Marvel um, comics. Watching the next issue of Spider-Man. Or something. I don't know. Or Guardians of the Galaxy. <laughs> I have no clue. Or he might be watching Superman or Batman or The Flash. I don't know. be watching DC or reading I mean what am I saying yay we got 33,000 all right one more uno mas and it feels like every time I play in Animal Crossing Happy Home Paradise I get like a, a little over a hundred thousand yeah, they give me a bonus because Darwin was the one who just ran towards me and be like, Hey, make me a hole. I'm like, alright, fine. Good child. He asked for much as a humble place to rest my head. Eh, sure, let's go. Big old pink grumpy panda. How many villagers do I have left? I have no idea. I made over 200 villager homes, so probably less than 200 if we're not counting special vi characters, but if we do include them, probably like about 100, 200 or so, I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, humble life. Man, I'm making like Japanese homes. Sorry, Pearl, you're gonna take- you're gonna be taking up for him. <laughs> what happens when you do them all? Then you're pretty much satisfied. I don't know, I probably may have to check if I've done the... The, um, the freaking whatchamacallit, the... Restaurant upgrade things that I was told about, because I haven't really bothered with that. As well as, like, donating money for the hospital thing. That was another option that I never did. But yeah, even after completing all of them, I guess like you're done. There's nothing left to do other than just come back, edit some homes or something. I don't know. Humble life. Yeah, he's gonna be humble with his crappy outfit, the frugal one. Of 
full sweater, lip hat, okay. Humble sweater and flip hat. Go with that and it matches his like pink color closely. Not exactly, but still. For the tulip hat. What colors do we have for that? I can go with that and let's see. Do we have like a tortoise glasses? Or is that? Oh, he looks weird with that. Let's go with that. Let's see, what do we have here? Meet again, tissue box. And also the phone. Don't say we got much outdoor stuff. Maybe this one. We probably use the the bridge, the the water underneath the bridge for that, but I don't know. me to see that like that every time oh are we even, like design his home hold up so since he's a panda we're gonna have to use that Guess we can go with that. I, I I don't know. I feel like his pink color feels a little off for his um character, but I don't know. Guess we're throwing the Lunar New Year decoration. See, this is like the only um Asian themed items I have are just holiday themed ones. throw in a bunch of plants since there's really not much for
since there's really not much for outdoor stuff that he has. Oh, for crying out loud. It would be nice if, like, yeah, I don't have any bugs with me to throw in, so it's like, whatever. It would be nice, like, if they could categorize, well, I mean, I know they have a category for that, but it would be nice if, like, for the order, you can, like, sort them or group them by indoor, outdoor items, but... Whatever. You'll just have to imagine how which items works you think as a an outdoor item. the wall photo and his poster shows of him kicking and all that like a kung fu warrior but he wants a humble life not a not a karate man or something pretty much gonna turn into like a japanese home they go expand it to like 10 by 10. Hi, Alan. Nice to see you here. Good evening to you as well. <laughs> I'm gonna go with blue. Just because I don't got much for it. Also, we might have to throw in... Partition. I'm surprised they don't have a green pillar. about you when I came in here. <laughs> I, I, I think you might be talking to her or something. I don't know. A table like a low end table yeah we have this one 
Oh, this one as well. We can go with that. Don't worry about supplying some stuff here. Let's go see. We'll put this here in the meanwhile. We have a bathroom, right? Oh crap, we do. Is that like a trash bin or something? Why have that big old bear booty? Like a cha 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 army? Bears do when they are done using the bathroom. Got this. <laughs> oh, we can throw in this one as well. No, we cannot use the tissue box as for that, so no. Wait, do we have a sink? Oh, we have an open frame kitchen. I thought we were, I thought there was like a bathroom sink. Like, crap, did I remember seeing one there? But I guess not. Oh well. Small table here. Don't know want to use a cardboard box for that. Um. Two. There is no small table. Come on. <laughs> I guess we're gonna have to use this wooden little table. Can I put it on top? Yes, I can. You know what? We're gonna do that. Monotone, colorful. Alright, so... gonna cook a fridge all oh, the way why do I have this when we already have that Simple table sure I don't have any dark color ones. You know, go with pink just to match this color. Although I didn't even like bother changing this color. Okay, hey, wasn't there a green one? Yo, go with green. Tuna. Yeah, we're gonna go with salmon because it kind of correlates well with Splatoon with the bear and the salmon. 
you know, with Salmon Run and all. The heck? I was starting to see like three different darker color variations for this rice cooker. You think it would decorate for every villager? Possibly. It'll just take me like months, maybe like another year or two to get through all of them. But like, you know, I'm playing this just for the longevity of Animal Crossing New Horizons. But yeah. <laughs> That's what you, yeah, yeah, you guys um, asked me just, you know, not to make sure or anything, but like, because, you know, I'm still going to be working on the, the home. It's just that, you know, it's going to be like... I'm just going to be way more picky on who I'm choosing because the villagers I see on Happy Home Paradise now, there's not many that interest me, but there's like a few that, you know, I'll, I could grow on a little bit or something. I don't know. You'd be decorating the new Animal Crossing comes out? Probably that... That could probably be one way. <laughs> New AC Copium. <laughs> Fictional or metaphorical opiate taken in order to cope with one is faced with loss or disillusionment. <laughs> yeah. I, and I figure, like, you know, it's not that a lot of people know me for Animal Crossing on my Twitch stream since, you know, the game came out or anything. It's just more like, you know, Happy Home Paradise, at least it gives me something to do than just go to my island, check the stores, get items, sell them, and do a lot of daily activities and tasks and all that every time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, man. All good though. So like, yeah, it's just more like you know. At least Happy Home it gives me a lot of um, you know, it gives me something to do, you know, being creative and thoughtful of which villager homes I'm making. So it's like it's cool. Ah, great. Just been doing other stuff? Yeah. Yeah. 
Toontown Town for a bit. Oh yeah, I know you were like on Discord. Well, you you have um yourself playing Toontown Town as your status message on Discord. So I'm like, <laughs> been at it for this. See, no 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 nothing um wrong with that. <laughs> nothing wrong with that and all. Like you know, everyone's finding finding something to do, it, and that's all good. A Dr. Mario discard? Ooh, that's cool. No food, right? Now you found a group who played that, been looking for about 30 years. <laughs> That's awesome. I could never find the time to do stuff like that because like I'm, it's, well, kind of because like, because I'm busy with like, you know, a job and all that, but, you know, it's just, I probably get like, personally, I probably get bored pretty quickly if I were to do stuff like this, but like, you know, always fun to stay dedicated on this kind of stuff, and I, I applaud. Also done a few music projects. Oh yeah, I forgot you've um, done music. That's cool. I hope you made some like good tunes. We'll make we'll keep like the Chinese slash Asian tradition with just that. Just throwing the vacuum cleaner. Probably like all the way over there. I find movie, music video. It's gonna be some Chinese pop, T pop, <laughs> cartoon. Oh, Mega Man, Mega Max X style Rainbow Road from Double Dash Recreation. Ooh, Mega Man 8 Recreation, just as the recent ones. Oh, not bad. Not bad. Pretty cool. What else? Honestly, if I didn't have to add in a second floor for this home, then I would have been done almost. But like, not gonna do that just yet. These are darker clothes I could go, so... Oh well. 
I guess I'll throw in Chow's photo, even though this is... Even though he's gonna have a bedroom up on top. I'm just throwing in there. Anything else? We can use the curtain partition to cover up. work with that. You know, it doesn't look too bad, the design like that. Also, I didn't even like bother checking the, the rugs. This doesn't look great this way. I guess I'll go with that. Alright, so let me see the wall stuff. I guess we'll throw that into the bathroom. We have these. We can use them as doorways. Hooray! Oh god damn it.
to work. I guess I'll leave it right there. Or this one. I'll go with that. I seriously wish there were like, you know, doors you can place and then like you can just either walk through them or you can just interact and then you can just open up and down. There's like so many missed opportunities that Nintendo could have just thrown in for Happy Home Paradise. And yeah, they kind of missed the mark there, but oh well. Maybe in the next game or potential DLC for their new game in their next console, I don't know. I don't have any music playing, but I figure I have to deck up the wall a little bit with some um, fancy schmancy stuff. There we go. It's gonna be a lot to unpolish up. I don't know why, but like. Before I start a stream, I just feel like so tired and be like, eh, I don't want to stream Animal Crossing, but I have to anyways. And then like, as I'm almost done with Animal Crossing, I'm like, not that tired anymore. I'm like, oh man, I have like, plenty of energy to like, finish this up and then I'll have like, whatever I have left just to do other stuff. <laughs> I don't know. Gonna polish up the entire table. Yeah, you know, I certainly wish. Well, actually, the thing I was gonna say, I really wish you could like, you know, select certain ones to be polished up. But then, like, there's this potential possibility, like, polish stuff that you know makes it feel unfitting, like polishing smoke on on a cold beverage it just wouldn't work out that way or just putting butterflies on on a telephone this wouldn't make this wouldn't work This isn't a bad home design I just made. We have like a small bathroom, small kitchen, small dining area, small living room. 
And well, the big the bedroom's pretty big. It's not too big. I don't know why I did that. I'm not even done yet. Why am I pressing L? God damn it. Do it again. Putting Drip drop on the tissues to cry, wipe his cries out. <laughs> I mean, then again, this could this bedroom could be the guest room. I am gonna make him a bedroom up on the top. color options, sadly. Forgot there were like secondary um, color choices for this one for the clothing. Alright, it's all good. I can throw in the tangled cord just for this. We'll see. We'll see if I'll keep it on there.
I don't think we got much. Anything else? Like, I don't want to throw in a lot of the things that I've already thrown in from the bottom floor. in the cardboard box. Okay, yeah, we can't even have too much stacked on there. God damn it. Wait, like, we can't stack a stack onto another stack when it's already stacked. Don't know if that made much sense saying all this, but whatever. <laughs> like his um playing right here and it I'll go with the natural wood just to match with the other colors here Alright, let's go finish this up. That's what I always say after every Friday on my shift at work every time. After I get off a of break, that is. I say that, it's like, I want to be done so I can just relax at home. <laughs> There we go. We are presto. I don't think that's the same many people say. Oh well. But well, we're done. Ah, 
of like how it turns out for this home. So the first floor specifically. Alright. Now he's gonna live his humble life as a Chinese panda. And yeah. <laughs> Oh, we're going to see a lot of partition walls in the way. That's just stellar creativity right there. Yeah, he's just enjoying his time. Just eating dinner and whatnot. I like how close up he is. <laughs> yeah, I like how it turns out. He approves? Yeah. Yeah, it's good battle. That makes three, because we did Pearl, Derwin, and Chow. Yay. Yeah, I'm done. How much do I have? Five million pokey. I like five point eight million pokey. <laughs> I still haven't really used much of the pokey because I already bought like a lot of the items I had. So, oh well. Wait, I could have worked on Peggy at home, but whatever. Oh, a hamper just showed up. Oh well. But yeah, we just pretty much went through this in about 2 hours and 40 minutes. At least 2 and a half hours. But like, Pearl was, went by pretty fast. Not too fast, but like, a little faster than average. Then the other ones, eh, I took my time as usual. Wait, I'm gonna go sell these because I have no need for them. Yeah, I don't know what I would do if I'm ever done with Animal Crossing's Happy Home Paradise DLC with all villagers, special characters, since I have access to all their amiibo, and whatever else. Oh yeah, I did change my outfit to the, the summer one. It's just, you know, Japanese themed and whatnot. I don't know, it's been like my go-to summer outfit for my character. I haven't really bothered changing the outfit for my second character on my second island just because I kinda like having her on her usual summer outfit even though it's winter time over there. Seriously, I wish I could just relax on the southern hemisphere throughout June, July and August. <laughs> Not having to deal with the summer heat, but oh well. But you know, since this is the main island, I have to like change the outfits for him. Or for myself, I should say. Because he's me. If I were now I'm crossing villager. <laughs> I 
You know, I've, you know, I've always updated my Dream Island every week, even though there's barely any change, other than like the the season and the months passing by. And I really bother updating on my second island much as well, other than like the last time I did when I got that Nintendo Switch All I membership on there, because I really bother with my second island much. But oh well. But I still update it from time to time to make a little bit more money whenever I sell them, as well as, you know, in case anyone's interested in visiting my Dream Island at their own spare time, I'm totally cool with that. I just don't think there's really much change I want to do on my island. That's pretty much going to be how it is. Even there's like a lot of messy weeds and other junk that I should get rid of, but like, I don't care anymore. <laughs> But yeah, I'm going to stop right there. I'll be back with more Animal Crossing every week as usual. As well as Pikmin 4 that I'm going to go through. I still got like tons of exploration. Caves to explore. Dandoris to accomplish and all that. I've done a lot on my previous um, Pikmin 4 stream today. So I've been having a blast with it. But yeah. Oh, wait. I need to like put this on so I don't forget. But... Thanks for watching. If you're new to the channel, feel free to follow. I'll be back with the usual games, like always. And yeah, I'll be um, playing through Pikmin 4 more. And I don't know. If I beat Pikmin 4, I don't know what else I could do left. But like, oh well. We'll see. But yeah. Anyways, thanks for watching. Thanks, Random, Owlet, and anyone lurking on the stream. I don't know. But thanks for tuning in. <laughs> I'll see y'all next time. Have a good night and have a good rest of your weekend.